Well, if you thought your pants were staying on today, I got some bad news for you because a flood of new OLEDs were just announced and oh boy, did they look good. Now, just last week, we were all collectively milking over the $1,000 27-inch 1440p 240Hz OLED that was posted on LG's website, but now we have information on several other size 240Hz OLEDs that'll be launching in 2023, giving customers more than one option if you don't want to buy a hideous LCD monitor which for some reason display companies think gamers are clown enough to buy over $600 in 2022. Yeah, I don't think so fella. But anyway, let's take a look at these bad boys starting off with the 45 inch OLED LG Ultra Gear and I'm not gonna pull any punches, this thing is gonna be trash. Now before you leap through your monitor and try and strangle me, just hear me out. First of all, it's going to be $1,700, which is a very big ask and honestly a reach for this display when compared to others available around $1,000. But what exactly do you get for $700? Well, you get a larger curved 45 inch 240 hertz screen with a resolution of 3440 by 1440 and while i do personally appreciate a curve on ultra wide monitors i actually think the 45 inch size will be a big problem because it's gonna end up looking like your friend smashed your eyes in with a lead pipe through a screen door with that large of a display only using a 2k resolution so ultimately it really doesn't matter how good the monitor is because it's simply too large to look good at the resolution it has and unless you want this monitor for some specific reason, I highly recommend avoiding it. But now let's move on to something a little more interesting, if not just as ridiculous, and that's the upcoming super ultra wide quantum dot OLED display from MSI. Now right off the bat, my chub is returning with force because from a gaming perspective, quantum dot OLED is definitely a better display technology, which offers much higher brightness. And at 49 inches, while this will be ridiculously large, it's very likely just two 27-inch 1440p monitors put together to make one large 5120 by 1440p display. So when compared to the 45-inch OLED from LG, it should have much better pixel density and just more pixels overall. Now, this is definitely ridiculous as having a 49-inch display wrapped around your Wii Wii, I mean face, will be a little much for some people, but with a 240Hz quantum OLED display, it will definitely be the best looking display ever created for gamers when all things are considered. So I'm definitely interested in checking this one out when it launches later this year, which by the way, hide your wife, hide your husband, and really hide anyone with eyes because I will be forcibly attending CES 2023 and I'm not taking no for an answer. So I will be covering displays like this whether they want me to or not. So make sure you subscribe to get updates on that when it happens because it is definitely happening. But anyway, the only questions remaining with these displays are, will they use a glossy finish or are they going straight into the trash and will we be able to buy them at a reasonable price in early 2023 and all i can say is my dumpster has plenty of room but in any case hopefully this helped you out with your future purchases and if it did be sure to drop a like subscribe and also i want to give a big shout out to rupro for sponsoring this video whether you're looking to connect a new console gaming pc or just need a fast and reliable hdmi cable to connect over long distances rupro has you covered with their rupro AK HDMI 2.1 fiber optic cable available in sizes ranging from 3 to 165 feet and can deliver a perfect full 48 gigabits per second connection over distances other cables could only dream of reaching. And with 48 gigabits per second of bandwidth, it can easily drive 8K at 60 FPS or 4K at 120 FPS HDR10 video through its ultra thin, flexible, and durable housing, and it even supports eARC. So if you're in the market for a cable that can drive a beautiful new TV or monitor, be sure to check out RuPro on Amazon today.